Hey guys, welcome to a new video. Today we're going to be talking about sunscreens, sunscreens for dry skin. I made a video for oily skin, so before my oily skin sisters come for me in the comments, it's already up. Definitely check that out. But today we're going to be doing mineral sunscreens for dry skin. I feel like dry skin just gets left out a lot, so no, we gotta, let's reel you in. We gotta talk about y'all too, because I know, I know this channel, I feel like honestly favors oily skin but that's okay that's just because i have oily skin but i thought about y'all today so let's get into it by the way it's freaking almost summer but i thought i should wear this top because it's very spring it kind of is ringing the end of spring here but we love to see it anyway yeah let's get into the video the video is not about me <laughs> first product is this one by CeraVe it's their new hydrating mineral sunscreen it's a tinted formula it has niacinamide for oil regulation hyperpigmentation salicylic acid for declogging your pores to prevent acne as well as titanium and zinc dioxide for obviously preventing those UV rays from damaging your skin it does have a white cast <laughs> I'm not gonna lie so this video, if I didn't mention earlier, is not just for dark skin because I know people are probably going to be like, girl, that's not going to work on my skin tone. This is for everyone and everyone that has dry skin. And don't worry, just be patient with me. Um, but I will be transparent and say this one does have dry skin, as you guys can see. But it's a beautiful formulation. I love the way it feels on the skin. Very affordable if you're on a tight budget. Um, and obviously, if you're darker than me, this would be perfect on your skin tone. So love it. I think Sarah did a great job here. Just wish we could be part of the celebration. <laughs> Something I also really like about this formulation is it has ceramide AP, NP, and EOP. These are the three ceramides that are present on the skin surface. So it's really catering to people who have compromised skin barrier. So if that's something you're also dealing with, or people that have eczema, things like that, this would be a great, great option for you. If you'd like more of like a semi-matte finish, this one is great because it has silicones that will easily vaporize, leaving more of like a semi-matte finish um, on your skin. It's their SPF 50 face sunscreen. I love it. Again, it does have a sheer white cast, but it's a great formulation. I think the ingredients are great for people with dry skin to help heal that skin barrier, nourish that skin barrier, help to really sealing moisture and seal up the skin from losing a lot more water and keep that skin hydrated especially if you're already using products that will keep your skin hydrated this is such a great product and your skin will love it all right third on our list is this one by coco kind is their spf 32 this is a fantastic formula it has zinc oxide 21 percent again there is white cast but if you're lighter than me you're gonna be great with this product. It has sunflower seed oil for fatty acids. And if you've watched my video on how to repair a damaged skin barrier, you know that fatty acids is one of the key essential parts of our of the lipid barrier of our skin. So very essential in sealing off that skin barrier and keeping it intact and keeping it in tip-top shape. This one also has glycerin for intense hydration, all the humectants as well to really keep that skin nourished throughout the summer and even the winter time. This is also a great wintertime sunscreen. But again. Don't come for me, it does have a white cast, but great formulation regardless. Now, for my dark skin sisters, you guys are gonna be happy with this one. This one was probably one of my best ones that I have in this list. It didn't really leave a white cast on me. I think this is also a new product from Kopari. It's their antioxidant face shield mineral SPF 30. Really great formula, feels really good on the skin. It has hyaluronic acid, zinc is the main sunscreen filter on this one. It also has other oils as well as ginseng root extract. Keep that skin very, very nourished, keep that blood circulation going. Really good formula, elegantly formulated, and I think if you're my skin tone, you really appreciate this product. Last mineral sunscreen on our list is this one by Bliss, is their SPF 30 mineral sunscreen. This is such a great formula. I just think it's elegantly formulated. You might disagree with me. So let's get into the white cast on this. So if you use a lot of it, you might see a white cast. It's a tinted formula. Iron oxide's in there does offset, you know, the white cast that you might be getting from just plain zinc and titanium dioxide. But if you use a little bit, you know, just like, just light two finger lengths worth. This is a great formula. Your skin will love it. It doesn't give a huge white cast. I think actually performed just as good as the Kopari one, but it's really up to you. If you like using a lot of sunscreens, then you definitely want to go with the Kopari. But this is also a really great sunscreen with minimal white cast. That's really all there is for the mineral sunscreens. But if you feel like, girl, none of these sunscreens are going to work for me, give me something I'll work, that'll work for my dry skin. I also recommend this one. This is actually a chemical. Only chemical I'm actually gonna throw in this video is by Skin Proud is their SPF 50 sunscreen. Really, really great formula. I really love the way it looked on the skin. Very dewy, very hydrating, just amazing formula. It's chemical, so non-mineral before you <laughs> get pissed at me when you buy it and it's not 
uh, mineral but really your formalin i thought to throw it in here for those of you that just don't want to deal with possibility of a white cast but yeah i think this is it for me i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did make sure to leave me a thumbs up subscribe to join the family we're here every week talking about skincare we love all things skincare over here we live we breathe we eat we you know i don't know you get the vibes you get the point subscribe and join the family for more skincare videos more skincare treats i love getting the inside scoop over here you feel me <laughs> subscribe and let's do this again next time bye